I'm going to show you how to do niche research in the UK marketplace. One thing that I recommend when it comes to doing research, Google is going to be your best friend in new ideas, researching marketplaces. What I did was just type in popular hobbies in the UK. You can see some of the stuff that popped up, video games, soccer, football, soccer, marketing, investment, sewing. But I came over here to magazine.co.uk, one of the top websites that are popping up, ranking number one. But I went down the UK's top trending hobbies. You're seeing rock climbing, roller skating, gardening, sup. I'm not sure what that is. Angling, golf. It goes on so far. Rowing. Interesting. Okay, so they have a lot of you, you know, a lot of like cool hobbies. But just for the idea of it, I would start typing in these into the UK marketplace on Amazon.com. So what I would do is come over here to let's say merch research. You just get an idea. So the first things first is get an idea. Merch research is the I've been doing this for five, six years, showing people how to do research on Amazon for t-shirt designs. Filter by this. You can hit search, then you can type in, uh, come up here, rock climbing, hit that rock climbing, see if it pops up, type this in earlier, but when I typed in rock climbing, it seemed to not work correctly. You can see the results. It's weird, right? I'm not sure why this is happening right here, but so we left that blank and hit search. So it's a lot of search results are popping up. You can see these are marked by Amazon shirts that are all popping up just to get an idea. You can come here the feature, leave that, or you can hit by newest arrival, how you would do it in the U S but I'm just going to come down here. I just want to see like the reviews, the ratings, just taking a look at what's going on in here. What's selling. You kind of get an idea. Obviously look at this, the United Kingdom, Great Britain, England flag. It's has 70 ratings, 78 ratings. It's doing some damage right there made in the eighties, the unicorn five reviews really cool do me a favor give this video a thumbs up so a lot of white shirts here boom boom all right 45 ratings you can see most of the so my merch by amazon account i'm at tier 200k most of them doing like the auto the auto uploading where the amazon merch is doing that for you i'm also when new designs i'm uploading to all marketplaces so if you're not doing that by the way make sure that you're doing that because if you're in the higher tiers the people in the lower tiers I was in the lower tiers at one time too, but I made myself up. I got into the higher tiers. There is less competition in other marketplaces. An opportunity for you to make over a thousand dollars, two thousand dollars a month in those other marketplaces. So make sure that you're uploading because take that very seriously because that's exactly what I would do. So there's that way to do that using the Google search, searching in there. You can even just type in the keywords into the search bar over here, amazon.co.uk. Just start searching Amazon like you would do. The U S marketplace, if you're uploading to the U S marketplace, you can see a basketball shirt right there. Then what I would do is come over here, copy, we're going to come over here to product search. Hey, you're going to see exactly, this is exactly what I did. Marketplace to UK. We're going to hit shirts only search. Now this is exactly what popped up rock climbing. A chalk of the other white powder. So we hit this. Let's see what's going on with this one. One rating, a BSR 47, 437K. We're not seeing too many other products sponsored under here. All right. Which is interesting. When you look at the all time sales chart, you're going to see that it's selling, selling pretty consistently. Maybe this is right. Look right here. Probably selling every other week here or every week here. Then it goes, whoop, and I'm pretty sure around this time again, it's going to start bump, kicking in some sales. So you can see it's starting to rank into the algorithm, right? Now, if we come down, we use the merch, the merch search, we're coming down funny rock. You're seeing it's just disappearing. Music teachers. It just may be because of the algorithm is still fairly new over there. Rock, paper, scissors. You're seeing the guitar, guitarist, music. Just bring it. Let's do be careful with that. Doing nothing like that. Aircraft. Scissors. Okay. All right. So literally what I would do 
roller skating. I'll just start typing in stuff. Searching Google roller skating. You're seeing roller skating pop up. We're going to hit search. See what pops up. Because this is interesting because it's showing rock climbing, showing 10K BSR. Roller skating. Okay. 72K BSR, average BSR. Now we're getting a little bit somewhere with this. It seems to be a little bit more direct. Kind of. Roller coasters. That's an interesting niche. That's a be a good niche to dive into. I never even thought about that. It'd be a cool one for the summer. Rollers. Retro. It's a retro style roller skate. Pretty cool design. Well, look, girl, you can see what they exactly what they did with this design right here. We're not sure if you're paying attention to that, but they made it look good on a white t-shirt. Also made it look good on the black t-shirt. This is what I always say when it comes to this too. If you guys have, you don't know what Merch Informer is, I'll have that down below. The description, my affiliate link is down there. So come over here. Let's check this out. Three ratings. Even got a review. Look at this. This is this basically when I look at stuff like this. I'm like, cool, this is really good because this is a consistent seller. The pricing, it says it's $12.95. I would raise that price, but it's cranking. This is ranking in the algorithm. It's doing some damage over here. So the roller skating niche would probably be a good niche to jump into. Let's check out the second one on the white shirt. See how that one looks. Because when we did some research over here, when we did a search on, where we do that search at? Over here, you've seen there's a lot of white shirts that are doing pretty good in the UK. So we come back over here. Look at, boom. It's doing some good numbers. And remember, too, the UK pricing is a little bit different from the US pricing. I'm not even sure if it'll give me a price. Let's see, currently unavailable. Pretty sure I have to be located in the UK to actually get the price. So it's unavailable over here, but it's listed differently. 13, 13 euros over there, 12.95 here. So yeah, the roller skating niche is good. That looks like it's a really good niche. And just like I said, just keep on going down. I'll go to, let's see how that bad boy is doing over here. If you guys get any value out of this video, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. You can see how I'm doing this too. I'm just going back and forth, looking at what's, if there's a demand, looking at these BSRs, you can do the same exact thing. You don't have to use Merch Informer. You can just use the, the Google search, and Merch Research. Like you can go over here to the UK.com, just use that Amazon search bar, dial it in and just keep doing searches and seeing what is there, what's there a demand for? And you're seeing like this pop up too. I'm not sure why this is popping up. I turned 15 lockdown t-shirt. I'm not sure why that's popping up because it's unrelated to what we're doing. But like this right here, for example, something. I just want to work in my garden, hang out with my dog. I want to work in my garden, hang out with my cat, hang out with my monkey, whatever animals they have in the UK. See if this is making any sales. No sell. Oh, yeah, it does have sales. But for some reason, it's not tracking it. Maybe just a, a newer product uploaded over there. Let me see. May. Yeah. Well, last month, but yeah, you see exactly what I'm doing. Just coming in here. Just want to see what, what, where's the demand at? If there a demand, what can I, what can I create that can be different in here? It's still fairly new when it comes to any of this search results. I do make consistent sales in the UK and Germany. And then there's days where I just make sales in all marketplaces, which is really awesome, but it's averaging close to 500 to a thousand dollars a month as I'm uploading, getting new designs over there. Like in the Q4, it does over a thousand dollars a month, which is really cool. Then everything else added up with all the other marketplaces, it's doing close to $3,000 a month. So that's just another stream of income. If you really think about it. So do not be slack when it comes to doing research and all these other marketplaces. It's really important that you do that. Like I said, Amazon search bar, merch informer, the merch research.com leverage those think of different ideas, hobbies, sports, so on and so forth. It's the same exact way that you would do. Research in the US, you need to apply it to every single other marketplace. If you got any value out of this video, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. If you guys watch this video right here, if you want to learn how I made over $200,000 with Merch Miles.